Thank you, Anne and Melanie. Good morning, beautiful church family. My name is Emily Jameson Guerrero. Hi, Melanie. Hi, Melanie. Oh, I love you. We love you, friends. My name is Emily Jamison Guerrero. I'm the Children's Ministries Coordinator at United Christmas They got Christian their church. Christmas tree. They sure do have their Christmas tree up. And we have our Christmas tree up too, don't we? Isn't that fun? We got two of our Christmas trees up. Yeah, we did find an extra Christmas tree in our attic that we thought we... <laughs> anyway, sorry. Good morning. <laughs> Today, here, there you go. Thank you. Okay. Um, we were talking about lighting our two candles today. So we lit our candle of hope, which is what we were talking about last week. And then we also today are lighting our candle of peace. And so I thought today might be a nice time to remember our sign for peace. There's our two candles. So if you take your hands and you just put them on top of one another like this, and you just kind so of mommy turn does them like that. So mommy does with our little finger and pull them out like that. And even as you're doing that motion, you can kind of feel peace. We'll take our pen and then we do it with our little finger. That's right, that's right. So and do it A. Yes, that's right, that's right. Annalise is practicing her drawing, right? Uh, her writing right next to me. So take your hands and we'll try it again. We're gonna take a deep breath as we do it. Let's try it one more time. In Godly Play, we talk a lot about um, Mary and Joseph on their journey to Bethlehem. Uh, last week, we talked about the prophet Isaiah. Mommy well. was telling the good news that the Messiah would be coming. And then today, we're going to be talking about Mary and Joseph and the donkey and their journey to Bethlehem. And oh, let's not blow them out just yet. Oh, also, Annalise had a birthday yesterday, and she got lots of practice blowing out candles. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh. I'm trying to blow out the candles. Yes. Okay. Oh, so we talk was. about Mary and Joseph on the journey oh, to Bethlehem and, and the yeah. peace that we want them to have on their journey. And so I've been thinking about the peace that we all want to feel on this journey of Advent and the journey of our stay at home orders and making sure we're keeping everyone safe. Mm -hmm. And so let's think this morning about ways that we can bring peace into our homes and peace into our world as we're all on this journey together. So I leave you with the sign of peace this morning and we'll say our prayer. Dad. Dear God, thank you for loving us. Thank you for the peace that you can bring into our world. Help us to know what we can do to share that peace. In your holy names we pray. Amen. God bless you. Peace be with you.